Hello everyone, St. Dorn here with another Vicky Quickie, this time on health systems. Are the institutions worth the cost? Let's get into it. So first things first, every law and institution deals with mortality. So what it does is it lowers the amount of deaths that are going on in your nation. Uh, if you're a huge country like the Great Ching and you've got 365 million people, your annual pop growth is 1.5 million people. You don't care about this. Uh, health systems will not help you uh, or actually it may even harm you because you're just going to have more people that you need to uh, employ. So I wouldn't really worry about it if you're this large. I'd say if you're anywhere between, uh, I don't know, 10 million people, is probably starting to get worth it um even japan you know uh, you know if you're hurting for population sure but uh in in general the, the grade ching and some of these bigger ones are not going to be hurting for population uh at all so uh that's the first thing so these you know any of these laws are not worth it uh keep it on no health system if your population is super large the first one is charity hospitals. Usually if you're a little bit behind, your nation isn't like super ahead like France or any any of these great powers. Uh, this is the one really to choose early game. Your religious group will have enough political strength or interest group uh, to make this actually happen. And then they'll get even stronger on top of it, which could be an issue. Um, every level of this, they'll go up plus 10% in political strength. So that is quite a bit. Uh, but also your mortality will go minus 5% per level, which is also very nice, uh, especially if you're a nation that's really hurting for population. So this is one to look for. And there's no tech uh, that you need to be able to do this one. Next one is public health insurance. This one, though, you do need a tech. You need pharmaceuticals, which is a tier two tech or error two. Uh, the same thing for private health insurance. You need this, which isn't uh, really hard to get, but that will take you a little bit of time. So if you're in a rush and you're trying to get your mortality up, you're probably going to choose charity hospitals first. But you can get public health insurance. And what's also going to be another little hurdle to get this is that this is liked by trade unions. And you can kind of check it here, too. Uh, if you haven't done this before, you can take a look and see what laws uh, an interest group generally usually likes. Their uh, leader of the interest group couldn't change these a little bit. But, yeah, you can see public health insurance is the one that they like. So, again, might be a little bit harder to get. So it's more like a mid-game uh, choice. But I definitely I like this one because uh, you don't make your religious group stronger. The last one is private health insurance. Here you get a minus 0.3% per wealth. Uh, so it's very similar to private schools. So we go here to the population and you can see here uh, what people's standards of living are and pretty much what their wealth levels are. And this is telling you, you know, what type of coverage they're going to get. And uh, definitely, you know, the more levels that you have in it, the better it's going to be. And what's nice is pretty much the people who are uh, the most wealthiest, who are paying the most in taxes are really are the, are the ones that are going to live longer. So Private health insurance, I think, is definitely uh, a good way to go uh, if you got your industrialist group uh, happy. So, you can, again, I think this is mid-late game. Um, then you can go this direction. And it's probably uh, the best, better direction. This would be even better if there was some sort of interest group um, like how they have for the intelligentsia for the private schools if they had some sort of bonus, uh, but it doesn't. So it's like a little less, uh, not as good as at private schools, but uh, I would still say if we're just talking about the health system in general, uh, this one's pretty good. And again, I would only really institute a health system if you need it, if you need those pops. Uh, if you're getting good migrations or you have a huge population, it's not even worth it. If you like this type of content, hit that like, subscribe, notification button. They're free. And as always, for the swarm.